This video will show you how to safely clean your battery terminals and cable. Go from dirty like this to nice and clean like this. But first I'd like to ask you to click the subscribe button. It helps the channel grow so I can continue to put out more useful content like this. Here's an overview of the tools required. First you're gonna need a good pair of safety glasses, some rubber gloves, a cup, uh, an old toothbrush, some baking soda, battery terminal protectors, and silicone dielectric grease. Make sure to use the links in the description below for anything shown here. You're also going to need a battery terminal brush and a 10 millimeter crescent wrench. If your battery terminal has a big acid plume on it like this, do not use a wire brush. Instead, pour hot water on it to remove it. Even though everything is pretty new and clean under the hood, I'm still going to run through the process to help prevent future corrosion. Start by taking your 10 millimeter crescent wrench and loosening the negative battery terminal. Next, remove the positive cable. Next, we're gonna take our cup and add some baking soda to it. About two tablespoons, you don't have to be exact. Then we're gonna run over to our favorite sink and mix in some water. About a one to one ratio, doesn't have to be exact. Next, we're gonna mix it up with our toothbrush. Make sure that it's pretty well diluted. Then we're going to scrub our battery terminals and neutralize any acid that's on the posts or in the cables. Make sure to give everything a thorough scrubbing. Next, we're gonna wipe everything down. Make sure all of this uh, baking soda and water mixture is off everything. Then we're gonna take our battery terminal cleaner. We're gonna use the round end and clean the posts. The brush end is then used to clean the cables. Make sure to put the terminal cleaner back together so you don't get stabbed with a bristle. Next we're going to wipe everything down one more time. These battery terminal protectors will help prevent future corrosion. Time to reconnect our battery cables, starting with the positive side. Then reconnect the negative terminal. Then I add a thin layer of silicone dielectric grease to the terminals to help prevent future corrosion. 